Hello, good evening. Welcome to our channel, Yushi Talk. And today we are talking about 1883 episode 9. Is Elsa going to die? We have a lot of details. Please continue to watch this video. Taylor Sheridan's 1883 episode 9 brought the entire story back to the beginning. Finally, we understand why Elsa was wearing a white dress and what happened when she was shot with an arrow with her parents seemingly absent from the event. The ending also brings a big question about Elsa's fate. Is she going to die? The episode hints at her accepting her fate moving forward. Shia, Thomas and James start to come across a Lakota camp that's been completely destroyed and they see the dead bodies of women and children in the wreckage. Shia realizes upon seeing the attack that the group is leaving the tracks that may lead the Lakota people to think that they are the ones responsible for attacking. The group ultimately decides to leave and kill the real attackers. However, Cookie gets caught at the scene and he is killed by the Lakota men who assume that he attacked their people. Elsa, who put on a white dress as instructed by Margaret Dutton, sees Cookie's death and goes on to warn other people. However, she veers off course in an attempt to spare some of the wagons, but still ends up getting burgeoned off and shot with an arrow in exchange uh, that scene in the first scene. So is she going to die? Elsa speaks to Lakota people after getting shot and tells them about her husband, which ultimately saves her life. Her wound gets cauterized, but she doesn't, and she doesn't die immediately from it. It gives us some hope that she will make it out alive, but the hope remains short-lived. The arrow that Elsa, you know, that shot Elsa pierces through her liver. It's very bad, and both James and Margaret already know about it. At that. This will more likely cause death. If we don't accept it now, she's going to die in some fort with some doctor chopping her up so badly that she can't see straight and we will have robbed her. James tells Margaret. So he, they decide that we will lie to her and tell her that she's fine. We'll let her look at the world with those big dreamer eyes until she can't see anymore. By the end of the episode, Elsa you know, feels a fever coming on. She develops a pain at the side of the bone. While her parents remain hopeful in her front, in front of her face, she already knows the truth. I looked back at my father, uh, looked deep into them, and that's why that's when I knew that I was going to die, Elsa says. So what's going to happen in episode 10? We expect James and Margaret will plan Elsa's funeral. Elsa will likely get more sicker in days to come as her, you know, following her injury. Uh, then as hinted by James that the next day is a mystery. James and Margaret also talked about Elsa's burial in episode 9. She is going to be another cross on the trail that we don't want to visit. Uh, Margaret tells, you know, James cheerfully, 10 years from now, it's just gone. Our wagon drive is over, James says. Where we bury her is where we stay. That's our home. So that's all we have in today's video. Please continue to watch the space for more informative news. Thanks for watching us. You have a wonderful day ahead. Bye-bye.